Alright, so this is my marble fingerboard ledge that I made. Uh, costed me like zero dollars. Really cheap. Costed me literally nothing. So it consists of two of these. And these are little samples that I got for free at Home Depot of just marble. You can just go there and it's like in the tiling or like kitchening department, something like that. So I just picked up two of them because that was all I really needed. So yeah, and then what I did was I found a piece of wood in my garage and then I cut it down to the length that I wanted. Um. And then I took the two things, and there's a little sticker on it right there. And then I made sure I lined it in the right direction because that's where it's evenly cut. And then I took this stuff called Liquid Nails. You can buy it at Home Depot. Uh, and I spread it all over the wood, and then I took the two pieces, and I put them on, and then I, put, and then I lined them up with, uh, like, a ruler, right? And I just made it flat. And then, and then I just, I put like a piece of wood on top and then put two weights on. So the weight distribution was even. I let it dry for 24 hours. And then, yeah, it was good to go. And there's a little bit of a bump when you grind it, but I don't really notice it. And it doesn't really affect it. There's a little bit of a bump when you ride over it, but it's not really... Big deal. Like, that was a bad example, wasn't it? If you're doing an actual trick, you don't really notice at all. So, yeah, that's how you make a little marble fingerboard ledge for like no price, which I thought was great because I didn't want to pay $20 for one from Black River.